I know a bunch of you clicked this video because you thought, oh, she hates Warframe. I'm gonna come shit on her and be like, this is why Warframe is great and you're dumb. Well, you guys, I'm about to be subversive as fuck and tell you that uh, I actually started playing Warframe again <laughs> and I have not actually quit. But I did quit and I'm gonna tell you why I quit. But why I quit has nothing to do with Warframe being bad because Warframe is... It's that. That's what Warframe is to me. I used to play Warframe a lot. Honestly, if you click this video, you probably have seen my other Warframe videos. TBH. This is why I quit and why I'm now back. You have asked. Nay, you have begged. You have pleaded. I think you have borderline threatened for me to play more Warframe. You love it when I play Warframe. I've made like four videos of total for Warframe and like somehow I was just like a Warframe phenomenon. I don't know, maybe it's all in my head. A lot of you are here on this channel because you discovered me through my Warframe videos, which while I appreciate it, is somewhat unfortunate. Honestly, I can't remember the last time I played a game that I hated. Oh wait, yeah, I can. Super Smash Brothers. Those types of games are the only games I don't like. I feel like I like every other type of game. So it's really hard for me to like commit to one game even though I know if I would just play more Warframe. You guys would be all over that shit. Yes! I've been playing it more often, so I feel like authentic to be all, okay, I'm making Warframe again. So yeah, since you guys clearly don't really want me to play anything but Warframe, and you're not interested in watching anything that isn't Warframe, like if I play other games, yeah, what's what we're gonna do? But first, I'm gonna tell you um, why I quit playing Warframe to begin with. It's not just that I just play other games a lot, and I just go through phases. I'm just like one of those people that I just go through a lot of game phases, and I always come back to games I like. I don't know, I skip around. I always want something like new. I don't know. I feel like it's been like a year and a half since I've been like seriously making Warframe videos. I'm like holding the mic towards my face so it's like sounds better on this camera. I'm just not good at camera shit, you guys. I just don't like it. I just wish I could press a button and everything is perfect because I really hate uh, the mic and the camera and the angle and the lighting and like, oh, that can all just fuck right off to be honest. So the biggest reason was I bought a better computer for my birthday. Um, well, Daddy bought it for me. Coming up on two years. So it's been almost two years. Damn, it's been a while since I've been on Warframe. Like two years, you guys. I mean, I've been on it off and on since then, but like I was hardcore on it. It was like two years ago. Like, man, time flies. So yeah, I just turned uh 27. And so he got me this Origin PC. Well, I, we gotta split it with like, I had some YouTube money and stuff. I got a PC because I wanted to play more games. And like at the time I wanted to stream more. And I guess I'm just not that good of a streamer because I can't seem to force myself to do it consistently. But I thought I'd buy this cool PC and then I could stream better and record games better and like make better gameplay. And also at the time I was hardcore into Warframe and I was like, yeah, it'd be super cool if I had a PC and I could play with PC Tenno cause that's where the party's at. And I also at the time really wanted to do Warframe collabs with other Warframers and they were pretty much all on PC. And so I was like, damn, I need a PC account. I got this new computer, but then like around that time I realized how fucking beast my computer was and I was like, I bet I can I can mod the fuck out of Skyrim with like every 8K res texture mod out there and like every quest mod ever and it would run amazingly and I was right but it took me like several months to get the whole mod setup going for Skyrim. So that was one of the reasons. So I got a better PC and then I just started exploring like PC stuff I hadn't really had access to and then I sort of like fell out of like the Warframe phase. And so why didn't I just go play some more Warframe on you know PS4? Because I do have like a really nice account <laughs> <laughs> on PS4. It's got like a lot of shit on it. I don't know, maybe it's not as good now. The whole game doubled itself since I was playing it. My channel grew really fast up until like 100k and since then it's kind of slowed down, but I think that's mostly my fault. And I'm just like also nice. I would add everybody. Like I accepted like every friend request to on PS4. I didn't even realize there was actually a limit to your PS4 friends because I hit it. And most of those were actually Warframe people and I added everybody and everybody wanted to be in my like guild on Warframe which was like super cool, but like I was definitely not interested in running a guild. That just does work, you know? My guild got like kind of out of control, like really big. I don't even know if it's still big. I think I gave it to somebody else, so who knows? It got to the point that I was like logging on to Warframe on PS4 and I just would get like so many people messaging me and just either on PS4 or in game and I just felt bad like being like, no, I don't want to play or no, I'm doing this with all these other people and I felt like I was always saying no to everybody. It made me feel like such an asshole. Um, and sometimes I would play with people and stuff for sure, but like I had a pretty tight group on Warframe, it was kind of just 
always full like as soon as I logged out, which is like a good feeling. Like this is a good problem to have, but I just felt like an asshole all the time. So then I just sort of like subconsciously was just not logging on to PS4. And then when I was like, okay, I'm just gonna start a new account on PC and not add everybody. And at least this way, maybe I can like do collabs and what I really, really wanted at the time. Like I wanted to get the updates as they came for PC. Cause I was like, oh, if I make more Warframe videos, like I need to have these updates as they come out. Because if I'm late with the PS4 crap, then like all the videos have already been made and I miss out on like that window of it being good to make those type of videos for YouTube, you know? And this leads me into the like my final and smallest reason why I quit playing Warframe. I mean, this is tiny. I mean, this is like minuscule. I cannot stress enough. This is like has nothing to do really why I quit. Why I quit was all those other things. I applied to be like a Warframe partner and I'd actually like had like tweets and stuff from like Rebecca. Like she's really cool. I mean, they knew who I was because they outright said that when I made my first video for Warframe, which was like my first impressions and I said, oh, I'm gonna choose Excalibur because I read that Excalibur is harder to get than the other two, uh, so I'm gonna be Excalibur, even though I really wanted to start off with Mag because I wanted to be a girl, because I just always wanna be a girl in video games, so. And as a result, they changed it and they made Excalibur like easy to get, that way people don't feel pressured to get Excalibur. So they, they literally changed this for me. So like, they knew me, like they knew I was making videos. So I don't know if it's just cause like my channel has like porn stuff on it and all this other random shit and you know, I'm not like a Warframe gaming YouTuber or something, but I applied to be a partner and like they rejected me and I didn't want to be a partner for like like an ego thing. I wanted it because they give you like access sometimes to new stuff with their like Warframe partners, which means you can make videos about it and the videos get views because it's like brand new stuff people don't have yet. And like, that's the biggest reason I wanted to be a partner. I have some like pretty high viewed Warframe videos. I mean, Warframe in general isn't viewed that much on YouTube, but what I have on Warframe like is. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. It just kind of was like the icing on the cake. It just sort of like bummed me out. And I was just like, well, I don't want to keep like making videos when like if I make a Warframe video, it does pretty well. I think the only one that didn't do that great was like my ribbon video. So I don't know. I think I probably needed a better title. So I don't know. I think it's probably, I don't think it has anything to do with me or my channel. I think it's probably just because I didn't make regular Warframe videos enough, but I don't know. I kind of felt like I didn't have to because there's just not that many girls playing Warframe. <laughs> and I would have made more consistent videos if I had access to cool stuff, but as it is, like the, another big reason I quit is just like, I don't know what videos to make about it. Like, yeah, I can play a quest and record it, but um, I don't know, I need your help. All of you guys keep begging me to play more Warframe, but like, I need topics. I just don't know what to make videos on other than like the ones I have. I try to make stuff on like, you know, Banshee and stuff. I honestly, most of you are probably just here for my fashion frame because I'm really good at fashion fashion frame, so maybe I should just make fashion frame videos, you know? Like, we'll be like the Sims 4 version of Warframe channel. I keep coming back on PC and like playing for a little while and then I inevitably keep quitting because like it is kind of a bummer to keep, to try to keep like earning back all this stuff that I already had on PS4 and like trying to get all my fashion frames going and it's just like a lot of work to like build it up again and on top of that, like there's so much. There's the Fortuna update and all these crazy reputations and all this extra stuff on the Plains of Eidolon and now they have this like Railjack stuff with the spaceships and new quests and like a shitload more Warframes and Prime parts and I'm just really overwhelmed and I have no idea where to start. I actually tweeted at Rebecca and I was like, can you guys give me my account on PS4, but like on PC, like just, I don't know, like a one-time thing. And like they said they couldn't cause like everything was separated. This was two years ago. So now I've read though, there's like a cross save in development soon. I don't know how soon, I think it's after Imperium or whatever, they're going to implement it. And so I'll be able to like get my PS4 stuff on my PC account, which at this point is making it even harder to want to grind up my PC account. Cause I know at some point, eventually the cross save thing is coming and then I can have my good shit back. Maybe I could build up this account and then like if I build it up enough then I could give my stuff from PS4 account like my like my maiming strike mods and Ar Argon scope and some of my ribbons and stuff I guess I'd be happy if I could at least just get like that stuff and like my plat off my PS4 account. I guess the other stuff was fairly replaceable. And then one thing that really irks me about PC, and I'll probably make a video about things I hate about Warframe just for clickbait, even though I actually love Warframe. But the biggest thing I think I hate about PC is that you have to have real money to, to buy Tenogen. And it wouldn't bother me. Like I, I like the idea of like paying the creators who are making the Tenogen stuff, but on PS4, it's for fucking plat. Okay, and it made it more fun to like play the trading game and earn prime parts and like spend hours trying to like sell stuff on the marketplace to get really good plats. You could use the plat to buy 
intelligent, but it takes all the fun out of it. It's just kind of like when it's just microtransactions and I'm just kind of like, I have bought Tenogen stuff on PC for the stuff that like I have to have, but most of it I'm like, if I don't have to have it, I'm not gonna spend money on it. I would spend plat on it because it's just something that's fun to earn. You know what I'm saying? So that takes a lot of fun out for me personally because you know how I am with my fashion frame, y'all. But with all that said, I really miss Warframe. I'm gonna start playing it. I have been playing it and I could really use your input on what I should be playing. Like, just tell me what I should focus on and please, like, oh my god, if you guys want Warframe videos, I will make them. But I need some goddamn ideas because my brain is just packed full of shit and there's just so much going on in it all the time and I'm always trying to come up with like YouTube videos that are not gaming related because that tends to do better, honestly. I mean, I guess not when it comes to Warframe, but I just don't know what to make of Warframe that would actually get views. You know what I'm saying? And don't just tell me like, make what you want to make, like, because I don't know. I just want to film myself fucking playing it and talking shit. That's all I can think of. <laughs> So with all that said, I really want to just go into Warframe and show you guys what I have right now And I don't even think I have any good fashion frame and I'll just show you around and you give me ideas And uh, then the next video I make about Warframe actually I have one really hilarious Warframe video idea that you guys will not see coming in a million years So make sure to subscribe if you just came across this video because it's gonna be so fucking hilarious <laughs> But uh, that's just my one idea. So this is my ship um i was like really surprised when i got here because i like, really don't remember this uh the skylight thing where you see the stars so like that looks really cool i don't really have my ship decorated because i just don't have like all that flat and craziness that i used to have on ps4 so i just have the basic coloring and stuff i like my little australian man plushie poor australia I did manage to get Nyx, um, so she's set up pretty much how I had her set up on uh, PS4. Uh, so there's not really much to show. Uh, I guess we can see my new operator. She looks kind of the same. And uh, <laughs> I still play PS4 controller. I can't, I don't know. I don't like Warframe PC controls. I don't know how you guys do it. And I tried to changing the key binds and I just would get carpal tunnel in my like these two fingers with the bullet jumping and just it's just so much better just like this oh it's amazing oh I love it mm. so satisfaction all right uh so she's cute I feel like she looks better than my other one I really like the this curly hair situation a lot of the haircuts were like a little I'm sorry, they just were a little too butch for me. I mean, for me personally, like I like butch looks on other people, but on my girl who represents me, she best has some hair. Yeah, so that's my girl. Oh, let's just look at my pathetic focus tree. I have nothing. <laughs> I have literally nothing. Oh my god. And I don't even know what like the focus farm is now because they nerfed Banshee, I heard. What the fuck is that, Warframe? How the fuck did you nerf my girl? Listen, she gets on her hands and knees, she sticks her ass in the air, she screams. How do you nerf that? It's amazing. All I have is my tea tray and a little picture and a little vignette. And I got Nyx looking like a queen and I have a carpet. So that's the extent. I love my colors though. I guess like we'll say, I think the graphics are definitely better. Not like so better where they're like, oh my god, like PC is so much better than PS4. Like they're not quite that good, but like it's pretty good. In fact, I don't know how I feel about the lighting. I feel like the lighting is a little different and I feel like it makes some of the metal look a little not good. Not good. Like, I don't know about you, but I don't want my ship looking so beat up. Or at least I want the opportunity to make it look fancy because this metal looks beat the fuck up i'm like the fuck i would have been polishing this shit like crazy like my ship would not be beat up i'm a rich sociopathic killer kid that i, I wander the galaxy getting tons of loot tons of money i have a very expensive 3d printer over here like why is my ship tarnished my ship in my world with my psychopathic killer kid who's rich would not have a tarnished ship so there's that uh as far as my stuff um, let's see. It's a little sad. For some reason, I have two Nixes. I don't know how that happened. Oh, I have Wino Prime? How did I get Rhino Prime? I got Valkyrie? Is her... How is her... Oh, God. Oh. Oh, what is this puke fashion frame? This is not good. This is not good. Girl, why do you look like this? I would not have done this to you. Oh, it's terrible. I don't know what I was thinking. Some of you are probably like, oh, she looks good, but no. No, this is not cute. Wait, do I have her uh, skin that makes her look like she has uh, boobies? 
Or no boobies? Let's see if there's any random colors I like. No. Uh, we're gonna make this uh, red. Yes. We're gonna make it very red though. But I guess she is a little scary, you know what I'm saying? We have like a white. Mm, maybe black again? I'm gonna have to mess with this for longer than it's gonna take to do this, so. And I got Trinity, who looks pretty similar to how she looked on uh, the other game. I got another Rhino. Do I have Volt looking good? Oh, my Volt looks pretty good. Volt's looking pretty spiff. Okay, I forgot that I made him look good. Uh, I guess that's what you guys really want at the end of the day, is more fashion frame videos from me. So let me know in the comments if you agree. Is Nova looking good at all? Oh yeah, okay. I got Nova looking pretty similar to how I had her on PS4. But yeah, I think that's, uh, let's see. So all I have right now is I got Limbo, who he looks pretty spiffy, I think. Yeah, he looks pretty spiff. I got Limbo, I got Mag Prime, Nova Prime, Rhino Prime, Nyx Prime times two, Rhino Prime times two? Why do I have two Rhino Primes? Trinity Prime, Valkia, Normal Malkia, Volt Prime, and that is all. I, I have so much to, get and i don't got many little relics at all i don't got much i got some stuff cooking so i got a lot of weapons to level up and stuff but i don't have that many primes so yeah i got a lot of work to do so tell me what you guys want to see so i can build up this account again and let me get like nyx back out of my loadout because she is the shit i don't even want to go over like all the stuff that's been added to this game is crazy that's not what this video is about but i don't know love you guys so much make sure you give me some more warframe video topics you want to see love you bye